The stakes are higher for second-year linebacker Chase Winovich as the boogeymen have departed Foxborough. I'm Sierra Goodwill here with Evan Lazar. We've talked a lot about how Kyle Van Noy, Jamie Collins, they're no longer. So Chase Winovich obviously had a really impressive rookie season, but he's going to need to make an even bigger jump in year two. Do you think he's ready for that? Well, I think the question is, is what kind of role exactly do they have in mind for him? And does he have the play strength to stand up as like sort of an outside linebacker in the strength of the formation on the same side as the tight end, the play side? That's going to be the most attacked point in the running game. That was the question about him coming out was just his overall kind of play strength, size, you know, 6'3", 250 is not exactly the biggest guy in the world to be out on the edge. So the question is, is can he have the power at the point of attack to push guys back into the inside and not just be a guy that chases down ball carriers from behind and does that sort of thing that we see him do so routinely and so well. You know, last year he played 29% of the snaps on defense, which is not a lot, but the main reason why he didn't play a ton was because the veterans in front of him, but also on top of that, he was mostly used as a situational pass rusher a year ago for the Patriots. You bring him in second and long, third and long, you know, sort of sub package situations and you let him rush on the edge or you let him kind of stunt uh, or you'd be the rap player on a stunt or blitz off the ball a little bit or from inside the formation, so to speak. So the question is, is can he expand on that role? He was obviously a stalwart on special teams. That's how he kind of got playing time early on in his rookie season. He sort of picked it up a little bit as the year went along and ends up playing almost 30% of the snaps on defense, but mostly as a pass rusher. So the question really is, is can he develop into a run defender that is able to be stout at the point of attack and not get pushed around by bigger tackles, by double teams, that kind of thing. In the recent draft, obviously, the Patriots went with Josh Uche in the second round, who not only knows Chase Winovich pretty well from their time at Michigan together, but they're essentially pretty similar players at the same position. Where do you see these two fitting in together? Well, that's what I really thought was interesting about the Uche pick is that you pick Winovich 77th overall the year before, and you're really high on him as a player as well. And then you go and you draft Uche, who is extremely similar in, in what he does on the edge. He's a speed rusher on the edge, much like Winovich. He's not going to be at the strength of the formation. He's only 245 pounds, so he's going to be a weak side edge rusher. That's going to be his role, which was Winovich's sort of penciled in role as well. But the one thing I think with Uche that's sort of different from Winovich is that he can play a little bit of inside linebacker off the line of scrimmage. So when these two guys are on the field at the same time, I think in pass rush situations, you could see them be their bookend outside linebackers because they want to get that speed, that athleticism, that pass rush ability on both sides of the line of scrimmage. That could be one way they could go about getting both of those guys on the field together. The other way is that Uche might play more off the line of scrimmage, at least early on in his career, play some inside backer, leave Chase on the line of scrimmage, scrimmage and that way there you have both of them on the field again at the same time but in different roles so I think that that's the difference between Winovich and Uche is that Winovich is really predominantly an edge defender he only did that at Michigan playing out on the edge or outside linebacker or defensive end with his hand in the dirt here he's only played stand-up edge as an outside linebacker in a 3-4 so Uche is the type of guy that can be a little bit more versatile do a little bit more than that so I think the Patriots have him sort of penciled in as an inside linebacker first and then a sub pass rusher like Winovich was as a rookie. And for more of our Patriots player profiles, you can check them out on our website at clnsmedia.com and subscribe to our YouTube channel at Patriots Press Pass.